Hello everyone, my name is Bryn and welcome back to my channel. Here on Bryn Darcy I talk about life and study at the ANU and what my life was like while I was studying a Bachelor of International Relations uh, there in Canberra. Um, but in today's video I'm going to be sharing something a little bit different and quite exciting um, which I haven't really had a chance to share with you yet. Um, so as you'll probably know I have been taking quite a long hiatus off YouTube um, I have actually been off, like not posting videos, not uploading videos, not really filming any videos for at least a month now. I was filming some videos while we were in Spain, but I wasn't really actually creating content. I was just uh, taking a break, having a relax uh, after finishing my degree. So there are a few things that have changed in that time, obviously, and also a little bit before that I hadn't quite been able to share with you guys yet. Um, but now I am ready to share them with you, I'm able to share them with you and so basically that's what this video is, just an exciting little life update. So the first thing is uh, that I graduated university obviously, I posted my final ANU video, uh, I think it was a week ago or so now, um, and that was the graduation photo shoot I did with my family and my parents. Um, and that was a really fun experience for me. The photos are lovely. Um, <clears throat> I have shared some of them on my Instagram uh, and on other platforms, um, but it's very exciting for me to have those photos and it's very exciting for me to finish my degree. I ended up finishing uh, with a high distinction average, so like first class honors in the UK. Um, and my final GPA was, 6.78 out of 7. Um, so not too bad considering I was working the whole time I was studying. Um, so all of that is very exciting. I'm so glad to have finished my undergraduate degree uh, and now I will be planning to do more uh, study in the future but I'm just waiting a little while, taking a little break first. Uh, having some time to relax basically and not make my brain do hard stuff. Um, the next thing that I want to share is that obviously you would have seen me spent a month and a bit in Spain. I've been posting on my Instagram which is here if you would like to have a follow and see basically what I share. Um, but I've been posting on my Instagram stuff from our Spain trip, which was lovely. It was great to be with Lewis's family and our friends uh, and just spend time with everyone after so long away after COVID. Um, so that was a wonderful experience. But the real reason why we were coming back to Europe, not only to spend time uh, with our loved ones, was the third thing, which is I've moved to the UK. Um, so Lewis got a job in the UK and we've now been living here since the start of August. I did post an update on my channel about this a few days ago. Um, I'm not sure if anyone has had the chance to see it, to see it yet, but uh, it would be great if you did have the chance to watch it and to just you know, hear all about that update. But basically we're living here in the UK. At the moment we are living in something called a co-living space. Um, so for the first two weeks, basically we were living in a hotel and that was not great. I was looking for somewhere for us to live and at the moment the housing market is very difficult to enter in the UK. Um, and really it was just too stressful for us to, or for me really, to be looking at all of these houses and then putting offers on them and, and trying to trying to get all of that sorted. So instead we've decided to move into a co-living space, which is essentially like a hostel for adults, I suppose, uh, for three months uh, while we look for somewhere more permanent uh, as well. And so basically in the co-living space, we have like a gym, we have our own studio room with everything we need in it. Uh, and we also have other, like we have a co-working space we have a library, we have this room that I'm currently sitting in filming my video, um, and just lots of other nice spaces to be around in, basically. Um, so yeah, we're going to be spending a few months here. I'm going to be doing a tour and a bit of a review of this place just so you guys could have an idea of what it would be like if you lived in a co-living space, because I know that this is something uh, that more and more people are deciding to live in. I think it's a really interesting concept and I would love to 
share what ours looks like at the moment. Uh, now, following that, to try and think of all of the things I had to talk about because I don't have my notes in front of me. Um, but the next thing was that I have started a business. So I have started my business, Adamas Consulting, uh, and it's basically a trade internationalization consulting business. Uh, we work bringing companies from Australia to Europe and from Europe to Australia. I am going to be sharing uh, in a series of videos about what it's like to start a business as a young person, uh, especially a multinational business. I do currently have some clients, which is very exciting. Um, but we're just, you know, in the early stages of starting the business. So it's not like uh, I've got lots and lots of clients on the books and lots and lots of things going on. Um, but I'm working really hard to build my portfolio of clients uh, and start doing more work in the future. Uh, basically, this is everything I had to update you on. I hope you enjoyed this quite short update video. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up. In the next few weeks, I will be sharing uh, more about us living here. I'll be doing more vlogs. I'll be sharing more UK content. So if you are excited for that or if you're interested in moving to the UK in the future, please follow the channel uh, so you can see all of the updates. Sorry, the camera keeps moving a little bit. Um, and also please leave any questions you have in the comments below or on my Instagram so I can answer them in the upcoming Q&A video about uh, my life, the future of the channel, everything like that. Um, so yeah, in terms of the future of the channel, I should just say this briefly at the end. Um, obviously, we'll be moving away from education content because I'm not in school anymore, uh, but I will be moving towards more entrepreneurial content um, and sharing my business journey as well as just what I'm getting up to in my daily life here in the UK because I still think that that is valuable and interesting for people to watch. Um, and I'll also be making some videos about how you can move overseas uh, as a young person and what it's like to be an expat out of Australia. Um, I know that a lot of my uh, followers before international students looking to come to Australia. So if you're an international student looking to come overseas, uh, not necessarily to Australia, but maybe to other countries, my channel will still be quite interesting for you. So yeah, anyway, thank you again, guys, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.